smoker went into that hole and look what we got yep it's the EGR valve luckily I got one of those uh, EGR valve o-ring oh I got something over here too So, <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, so those are leaking also. This I fixed. This is your other common one. That the O-ring just crushes. I mean, becomes hard as hell. You take that off. You can just reach in there with your hand. Take off this screw. And that other screw. I think it's Torx 25 or 27. Pull it out. And there's an O-ring on it. And that goes bad also. All right, so we definitely got bad ones there and definitely bad there. And I believe those. So I got that O-ring there. Of course, this says it's only for Ford up to 04 which I think is bullshit that looks like the exact EGR tube o-ring which says right there and I have the other ones those puppies for the intake gonna do this today I finally ran out of smoke Almost. I'll do this another day now this car has it had um, um, lean codes uh, lean codes rich codes there were all those all those as soon as I fixed the um, this one there, the lean cones went away, but it has random multiple misfires. The engine doesn't idle good, it doesn't run good, it's always misfiring. The Mode 6 data shows misfires on pretty much all the cylinders randomly. You'll, not a lot, you'll get like one or two per ride and it'll change around. But it's definitely got to be that leak and as we saw the leak there on the intake i guess these are very notorious for all those o-rings leaking it's crazy i even i replaced the all the plugs and wires i replaced the um the coil before i knew about all this other stuff and of course the stupid thing down there where is it that stupid <laughs> Where the hell was it? That was underneath everything. That, um, what do you call it? Uh, the timing thing. That thing, of course, is squealing. Not as loud as it used to. Um, where the hell is it? I could have swear you could look right at it. Oh, I think it's under this. Is that what's going on? Oh, it's, I, think, I believe it's directly under that. That's actually it, isn't it? But that is that is chirping. It used to chirp a lot louder. Now it's not as noticeable. 
but I think if I fix these vacuum leaks, the mist virus will go away. All right, so what's the next step? Another video, I guess.